Hi everyone, it's Don from Don's Family Vacation and a lot of you ask me why do I like Princess Cruises so much? So, in this video, I'm going to tell you why I fell in love with Princess Cruise Lines and we're going to tell you right after this. First off, Princess Cruise Line is a premium cruise line, which puts it above Carnival, Norwegian, Royal Caribbean. It's on par more along the lines of Cunard, Celebrity, uh, Holland America. So you know it's made for a little bit more of a luxurious cruise. Second of all, the food on board, you don't have to order from a specialty restaurant because the buffet and the main dining lounge have excellent food. Some of the best food that I've ever eaten at sea has been on Princess Cruises. Another thing I like about Princess Cruises is that it's geared towards a more adult clientele where you will have Carnival with Dr. Seuss and you'll have um, Norwegian and Royal Caribbean bringing out things like flow riders and skydiving, things like that. Princess Cruises is geared more to the adult clientele. And while those cruise lines will bring out innovations like largest ship in the world with the Oasis class or they'll bring out flow riders or skydiving or robotic arm bartenders, well you know what my 75 year old grandmother is not going to jump on the flow rider. They don't care if there's bumper cars and she's certainly not going skydiving. So what Princess Cruise Line does is bring out innovations that is for everybody more or less instead of like people who would have to be specialty in those areas for instance they were the first ones to bring out movies under the stars for everyone to watch the first large screen movie projector was on the the caribbean prince uh, princess so there's an innovation that everybody can dine they were the first to bring out regular and my my timing any anytime dining as well. They were also the first ones to have balcony staterooms that weren't suites so more people could afford balcony staterooms. They were the first to bring on wedding chapels onto ships so you can get married at sea if you want and the newest renovation they brought out is medallion which is basically like your Walt Disney World magic bands where you don't have to walk around with a card anymore it's like a little wrist wristwatch that you wear around your hand and it acts just like your card for your room it keeps track of you people can find out when you're on the ship the cast and the crew members can know that you've crew you've sailed with them before they know that you like a particular type of dining they know you like a particular type of entertainment they know when your birthday is they don't have to ask the medallion tells them and it keeps track of you so again princess brings out reno uh, renovations innovations geared more towards everybody than specific cruisers in a particular kind of area while Princess Cruise Line can be compared with Cunard and can be compared with Holland America. They have a wider selection of ships and a wider selection of destinations. For instance, Alaska. They are number one in Alaska, have been for numerous, numerous years, and it's no wonder. At any given time, they could have eight different cruise ships sailing that itinerary. And they have the land-sea combination that you could do as well which combines with staying in cabins and resorts in Alaska and you take by train and then you get back on the cruise ship. It's an experience all in itself and they have some of the best itineraries in Alaska you'll ever get on. And whenever I think about going to Alaska, Princess Cruise Line is the first cruise line I'll think of. Another thing that I really like about Princess is they take the time to design their ships for itineraries. They were the first to design a ship specifically for the Panama Canal. Their ships going to Alaska are designed to go to Alaska. They just brought out a brand new ship for Asian markets that's all themed towards the Asian populace. So they take the time to distinguish where the ship's going to be placed 
And it's not a free-for-all ship that can just go anywhere. It's designed for that area, which is another thing I really love. Again, keeping in mind Alaska and everyone knows how much I love nature, Princess Cruise Line has partnered with Discovery and Animal Planet to bring enrichment programs. And yeah, when they're talking about seminars at sea and stuff like that, they talk about enrichment. So if you're going to Alaska, you'll have local people having seminars on the ship to tell you about those areas. If you go to Asia, you'll have, again, the local populace will be out there teaching you about those areas. It's all about learning and creating new experiences while enjoying your cruise. It's not just about how many beer you can have and uh, wine tasting while they have those things too. They also have the cultural things, which I find after cruising for a while is what I really want to be doing. And lastly, I'd have to say one of the biggest things about Princess Cruise Lines to me is the service and the people on board. From the people who are answering the phones when you're making the bookings, to welcoming you on board, to the staff, to the stateroom attendant, to the waiters, I've never had anyone complain to me. Any of my clients have never come back and said, you know what, I had the worst experience with the staff on a Princess cruise ship. And that's gotta be, so that, that's gotta say something. So service, innovation towards I'm looking for, number one in Alaska, nature enrichment programs. What more can you say? The food on board. Princess Cruise Line just speaks to me in a way that other cruise lines, while fun to be on and I enjoy being on them, if I have my choice, probably going to try and choose a Princess Cruise Line. So that's why I love Princess Cruises. Let me know what you think about Princess Cruises down below in the comments below and compare them to another cruise line that you think matches them or is better than they are. Until next time, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos, hit that subscribe button. Until again next time, have a safe and a great vacation.